Okay, I am so, so, so excited to introduce you to Bruce Kiesling, the music director and conductor of the Sequoia Symphony Orchestra. Bruce, thank you so much for being here. How long have you been with the symphony? Thanks for having me. I'm thrilled to be here for sure. Um, I've been with the symphony actually just over 12 years. So wow. entering that part of the phase, which it's been an amazing time to be with the orchestra and really see our audiences grow and change and also the orchestra continue to grow and change so wonderfully. How long do people typically stay in the orchestra? Well, we've had some people who stayed decades in the orchestra, and it's been really encouraging because we've also had a lot of young people um, from Visalia who are now maybe music teachers in the area or students at Fresno State, etc., who also come. And maybe some of the students aren't here as long, but one of the most rewarding things that I've seen here is maybe some of the students who I knew in here in Visalia when they were high school musicians, uh, they eventually went to college, were music majors there. They're back in town now teaching music at some of the high schools in the area, and they're now playing as professional members of the orchestra. So to, to, to see really that, awesome. yeah, really, really special, inspiring, and they're such wonderful young musicians. That's awesome. And how, what is like the furthest away that someone in the orchestra lives? Uh, well, this week we have someone coming from Santa Cruz who's driving over, so it's about a three hour drive. But one of the things we're proud of here is that, you know, our orchestra, although they're all professionals here, you know, we don't have a bunch of people from LA or San Francisco, which other orchestras do, but we kind of pride ourselves on most of our members are really right here in the Central Valley. So sure, we draw from Fresno, uh, but also here in Visalia and maybe down to Bakersfield, but that kind of stretch of the Central Valley, our home area yeah. is really where our musicians come from. And we're really proud of that and proud to be an artistic outlet at a really high level for those musicians to participate in. Yeah, it's a very professional, very beautiful, very well organized orchestra and I love that you have the movie nights when you guys oh, yeah. play like the Star Wars music and watch the movie at the same time. Those are so fun. Yeah, that's something I've, I wanted to do here for a long time um, because I'm a huge movie fan myself. I love films and certainly one of the things that brought me to movie music when I was a kid I remember listening to John Williams and the Boston Pops on the mm -hmm. radio and the chance to really I think if you really want to enjoy great film music the best way to do that is to see the film as well and it's been wonderful and gratifying to see our audience has followed us to that so some of our most successful events here have been when we did Star Wars or when we did Home Alone for the holiday season yeah. Indiana Jones was a real highlight too so it, it's really great to be part of that and I was saying to people after we did E.T. the extraterrestrial it was really I was very moved because I remember seeing that film as a kid and to just be a tiny little part of the storytelling there you know leading the orchestra through the music while the film is playing up there and you just feel like wow I'm a little part of this great yeah. just magnificent film. That is so incredible yeah. and to have it in the Fox Theater. Do you do all of your shows at the Visalia Fox? Yeah I'd say 98% of the concerts we've done over these last 12 years have been here and it's so special this is a real community gem and I know that when the refurbishment of the theater when it went you know because it was a movie house for a while mm -hmm. and when they converted it back into a concert mm -hmm. hall um, one of the reasons they wanted to do that was to bring the orchestra back because we had been what? playing at a different venue that was before I was here but I know a big part of it was this community wanted the orchestra to be back here downtown in this amazing venue and so along with the orchestral shell which we purchased to kind of help the acoustic in the room because it was really built as a movie house which doesn't necessarily mean it sounds great for orchestras yeah. so but the purchase of our shell and uh, has really helped to get our uh, or, or audience to hear our orchestra at its very best that's amazing how long have you been a conductor well uh, this is kind of my second big job so as I said I've been here 12 years but I was in a previous position for eight years before that so I've been professionally conducting for about 20 years wow. and I figure in about five more I'll know what I'm doing a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's really awesome. Is there anything else you want to add or any other fun stories? Well, I just think, you know, it's, it's a real gem here and it's been incredibly gratifying to be coming to Visalia regularly for these past 12 years. And I've just seen a transformation, even right here on Main Street, how much it's grown, the great restaurant.